as I stand at the foot of the mountain, I stare up at my enemies. They look scary. What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play Ocarina of Time. <laughs> In this episode, we destroyed the staircase. We came up here, and we figured out there's a golden skull here, but I'm a dumbass. And I didn't have enough freaking Deku seeds on me. So when I said I promised that I would go and get Deku seeds off screen, so I did. I went, went to the baby Dodongo room where I had trouble exploding the wall. You know, last episode in the bad luck episode. That's right, I'm referencing the episode name right after this episode. Or that episode, I should say. Which is different. Because normally I have no idea what the heck I'm going to call an episode until I'm uploading it. But sometimes I just think of something cool as I'm, you know, um, saving everything. Uh, so there we go. I got that freaking thing, thing my bob, you know, the skull, the golden sculpture of Mata. Uh, all right. I hope these guys aren't alive because that's gonna suck. Are you alive? Sir? Excuse me, sir. You're kind of in the way, you asshole. You asshole. Oh my God! What the heck? Fire keys destroy before it flies into you. If, or if you don't, it's fine, we'll burn up again back a shield. Look at it, it's like all skeleton looking. Uh, nope, didn't think so. That's weird, that, I've never seen one up close before, but no. Of course, now I'm just getting Deku seeds up the butt. Of course, of course I would have. What a weird place for a switch. What's even the point of this ladder thing? Oh, no, no, no. They only have one, oh, never mind. I thought they only had one eye. <laughs> I don't even think anyone's going to be able to see that on the resolution of this video. Maybe. Right. Okay, this is not the room we just entered. So, are you guys actually- Oh, they are alive. Okay. If you tap into them, they come alive. Are you alive too, sir? You're not alive! Oh my god, so everyone but the one we have to push is alive. Interesting. Oh god. I am not dealing with those assholes. I take way too long to kill. And taking on three at once would probably be a bit of a challenge. <gasps> and we're back to the main room, actually. But on the second floor, you like how I said, why is there grass in a volcano? What is this? Seriously? More? S'mores? I love s'mores. Look at that. It looks so cool. It's just, <laughs> it looks like he tries to say something. He's like, hey. <laughs> oh, Skellington. What's this? Oh, no! <gasps> Oh my god, I panic jumped there. I thought that there- Wait, is there anything down there? I don't think there is. No, that's just the front of the dungeon. I was gonna look at the map, but I decided that's kind of pointless. So there's no reason to jump down there. Oh, this room. I have memories of this room when I played it. Holy crap, actually a long time ago. This is before I moved. This would have been six, seven years ago when I first tried to- Seriously? When I first tried to beat this game, but then I failed. <laughs> you never know what could be around these corner. Right, around the corner of these narrow paths. You don't say. You see the and it always look in the proper direction. This is a useful technique, isn't it? I can't. I zip saw baby ball. I just always have to zip saw baby bob. Oh crap! Before I do Navi's voice, because otherwise I forget what Navi's voice is. <laughs> it's not weird. Um, in this room. Oh, well, that's a pointless ladder. But not really. Um. Okay. Yeah, this room was actually has a bit of a memory in me. This ledge right here. I had to crack my toes when I was here, so I like, you know, I pressed my hand to my toes and I tried to crack them. But then all of a sudden, and thank god there's not like um, Twilight Princess where if you get a chest and you don't have enough rupees, you don't collect it. I hate it when I can't collect chests. It bugs my OCD so Oh, I thought I almost got them on the first try. But yeah, I tried to crack my toes in this room and I dislocated them. And it sucked a lot. Yeah. Oh, no, I totally want to throw you, actually. Help. So there's two ways to actually do this. But yeah, so that's my memory of this, actually. For some reason, I just remember freaking dislocating my toes, and it hurt a lot, and I had to, like, put them, push them back into place. Okay, I gotta remember where I was standing. I was standing right before the first leave on this plant. But yeah, there's two ways to do this. Either you wait for the spawn to explode, which I'm gonna try right now, because it's the less obvious thing to do. And time it like that. Nope. Okay, I did way too early there. Or you gotta throw perfectly so it lands on the ledge. I totally thought I was gonna land on the ledge the first time I threw it, but no, oh God. So this might take a while. <laughs> so this starts to take too long. I'm gonna probably fast forward it. Oh no. I thought I was gonna roll off there. Alright. Ah, still a little too early. 
Okay, I just gotta freaking remember exactly where I'm standing here. I don't feel like these grow back. They grow back so fast. Alright. Oh, if I could just get stuck in between that ladder and that wall, that'd be perfect. That'd be El Perfectio. What? It totally stood still there for like a half a second, and then it's like, haha, <laughs> just kidding. Yeah. I don't understand why that block is also like underneath that ladder. Like, couldn't they just make the ladder longer? <gasps> Holy crap! That was perfect. There's no. I can't even, like, my mind is just blown. Well, that was weird. That was glitchy. See, why is this block here? Is there a reason? Can we, like, move it or anything? I've always wondered that. Grab it. Nope. Grab. No, can we pull it this way? I've always wondered why this freaking block is- Because it doesn't make any sense! Like, why couldn't there just be the ladder going all the way down? Oh, you can pull it out. Is there something behind it or anything? Is there a reason to pull it out? <gasps> There's a secret room! Oh, it's just a heart. Well, that's weird. I feel like there's something supposed to be there, like, more significant than a heart. Right? I don't feel like that's significant enough, and there's an entire other portion of this room up here. Well, crap! Well, I can tell you there's no bomb I can pick up to bring over here. That, like, you know, it wouldn't explode in my hands before I got over here. Too short of a fuse and such. Oh, no! Well, I'm stuck. I can't see. I can't see. I can't see clearly. Seriously, get out! Oh my good lord, fine, take all the damage in the world. So I guess that explains why this block is here, because there's just a weird pointless heartbeat behind it. But seriously, that feels like... That's so strange, isn't it? Like, I feel like there's supposed to... Good lord, I feel like there's supposed to be like a significant chest or something behind there. Uh, hmm, I wonder, actually, maybe I have a theory coming to mind right now. Can I seriously not get up here? So I can't grab the ladder while I'm jumping. <sighs> fine. I need to get around somehow. Oh boy, this is so freaking annoying. I, I, I do actually have a theory just coming to mind right now. Maybe there was initially supposed to be like a key in there or something? Because there's, if you notice, there's no keys in these dungeons. At least there was no keys in the Deku tree. But there hasn't also been any keys in this place. That's because there's no keys in the first three dungeons of the game for some reason. I guess because they're more like tutorial dungeons and all that. Um. There's nothing else in here, I don't think, right? It doesn't appear to be. All right, just making sure I'm not missing like a golden skull chill or something. Oh my gosh, my baby dung dung go, my baby dung dung. Oh no, I didn't hit them! Ah! Be gone from this place, mortal. But they're not mortals, they're... Wait, are mortals humans or mortals just mean you can die? The bitches again? I already killed you bitches. Alright, so let's not defend you with this shield here. I thought I showed that, but <laughs> just to reiterate. Are you gonna come back or just go laugh at me? I'm not playing you well, fine, I'll jump to the middle platform. Come on, bitches. Can you attack me? No? Okay, fine, I'll attack you. Kid, seriously? We can target you? Yeah, so there's no keys in the first two dungeons, so I wonder if there's, like, maybe there was gonna be keys, but then like, they decided, nah, let's not put keys in this dungeon because there wasn't any in the deck tree or something and then they just replace it with a heart or something. That feels like something like, that doesn't, that, no, there's no way there could've just been, like, a heart in there and that was it. Are you serious? not gonna give me a heart? Fine, you ask me. Come on, get over here. Get over here! Oh, please don't fall off. Um, I kind of think something I, th I feel like you fall through this lava. I'm not entirely sure. No, you probably don't actually. Should I test it? Let's test it. <laughs> Testing for science! No, you don't. Okay. I feel like I was gonna be like really suspended lava for some reason. There's gonna be some under here. Oh, what's that? I think there's hearts, but. It looks like you can look down here. You can. <gasps> well. This sucks. Fuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuu
Anyways, I'm still making my way back downtown, walking fast. Is this it? Might as well just, should I just might as well start to, oh no, we're, we're almost there though. And I'm back, come on, get up there. Seriously, okay, I wanna try this again. I wanna, I wanna see the view. Please don't fall down here. It took forever to get back here. <laughs> I'm so scared. This is cool. See, this is really pointless, but I mean, it's it's really cool little detail. And stick, get out of my face. I don't know, how do I put this away? Okay, that's how I put it away. <laughs> see, it's like, this is pointless, but you know, it's here, and it's neat. And you can even see the pots and stuff down there. What, you can't see this place looking up for some reason. Oh, there's lava falls. That is the coolest thing ever I have ever seen in my entire life. I am so nerdgasming right now. Not really, because that's weird. I'm nerdgasming all over the floor. <laughs> I honestly probably should have went to that business scrub and I got myself a deck shield. Is this not the way I just came? Hello? What? Wait, what? Which way do I need to go? Huh? Is it this way? Wait, where does this bring me? I think this is right. Right? Oh, it is, because that little room on the left that was in there before. What the heck is in there? I don't freaking know. Oh, I see. Just gotta double it up. Oh, can we... Oh, well! Well! Um, we are on a bit of a time limit here. Seriously, Navi? I just want you to describe what that is. That's all I want from you. Okay, well, fine. Be an asshole. We'll see if I occur. There's no way... Yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> there's no way that that, should, that was going to work. <laughs> Never was gonna work. I was gonna question... How silly this game is. So yes, these eye switches are on timers. I guess the yellow eye switches mean they're on timers and the blue eye switches mean they're permanent? Which is weird because it's the complete opposite for switches, but I'm pretty sure there was a blue eye door in the Deku tree that like I hit it once and I, that door will stay open forever. So, you know, whatever, I guess. <laughs> Alright, let's go through the door. How much time do we have? Oh, we're only at 11 minutes. Probably a bit more. Okay, don't fall off this room. Don't be stupid like me and fall off this room. What's this? Well, I know what this is, but I mean, you know, since we already got the uh, the map and the compass, it's gonna be one thing. The very mysterious outlines. <gasps> bomb bag! Oh yeah, it's a bomb bag in this game. You found 20 bombs inside, now you can send bombs to see him blow shit up. What a lucky guy! Blow shit up indeed. I love blowing shit up. That's actually really disgusting. I don't know why I said it. I apologize. Uh, what is else is in here? Is there anything in here? <gasps> okay, there's just that room over there. I guessed because I thought I was gonna fall off for a second. Then it really scared me, quite frankly. Um, hmm. Well, now which way do I go? I mean, I guess I go this way. You know what? Let us go this way, actually. Okay, there we go. Now we have a shortcut. You take the shortcut and I'll take the long cut. Should I do this now? I guess so. Uh, I don't know which order to do this in. Are we seriously? Whoops. We don't have much else, much left to go in this dungeon. I don't think we're gonna have enough time to beat it in this episode, but we're pretty close. Which I mean, yeah, three episodes is pretty average for completing a dungeon, really. Um, unless you're speedrunning this game, in which case, if you're taking any longer than freaking an ep a 20 minute episode, then you're a silly little poop head. Alright, I should probably take my Aquaman off my hot bar because seriously, who uses that? Nobody. <laughs> uh, open this door. Let's see what's in here. It seems to be a one way dead end room. Oh my god, it's murder. Mer 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 oh, do I have to face you backwards, Lee? Do I have to face you ass backwards? Do I. How the heck do I. What? I guess I can hit you with that kunat, okay. I mean seeds. Seriously? You need to leave, sir. I surrender. In return, I will sell you Deku nuts. Deku nuts? Why would I care about Deku nuts? What? Damn it. I forgot pressing B in this game doesn't isn't no, it just whoops. Pressing B in this game just advances the text. It's the same as A in this game. Alright, you win. Deku seeds. Uh 30 piece for 40 rupees? Um, no, I don't think so. Yikes, I'm going home then. Are you gonna drop hearts too? No, you're not. I guess I only drop hearts if you give them business. 
Well, that was pointless. <laughs> I don't think there's a way to get up there. Well, I mean, there's kind of no point. That we activated that pillar. It goes super high up into the sky now. I almost feel like, oh, good lord. I almost feel like I should just meet you guys back in the main room. You know, I'm going to do that because this is kind of a long walk, I guess. So... No, I was, I was gonna say, I wonder if it's faster to just continue through the dungeon instead of backtrack. Oh, it's definitely not. Never mind, because we're here right now. Right meow. Look how tall that pillar goes. Well, it didn't go tall at all, actually. I lied. Mm, I'm really tempted to go buy a shield from that Deku scrub, but it's such a far along walk. Not really, but I mean. Yeah. So we have portable bombs now, which is fantastic. And I got. Oh, good lord. Bombs are actually my second favorite gate. Or item in the game, in any Zelda game actually, the first being a spoiler item, but it's normally one of the later items you get in the game, and has to do with grabbing things. <laughs> with, that sw with that switch on, the move platform goes high, and I can quickly reach a second floor. <laughs> Thanks, Navi. Thank you. I don't know what I have done without it. Whoa! I missed this! How the heck did I miss this? Giant dead. Oh, wait, this is probably Navi being this, isn't this? Because Link can't read. When it sees red, a new arrow to go will be open. See, I really like these kind of puzzles. It's like, what the heck does that mean? It's very cryptic. It's very mysterious. Oh, we could go this way. Duh, dummy. Of course. It's a horse, of course. Get out! I'm gonna die soon. Drop a heart, please. Of course. Now that I don't care about Deku seeds, that's all I'm getting. <laughs> My life sucks. So this is when it sees red. Hey, there's this bridge, and we can jump across it for some reason. Oh, there's a little, there's a secret passage up in the door. Yay! That almost landed on my face and exploded me. Seriously, we just drop it. The way bombs work actually is if you're running or actually moving like at all when you're holding a bomb, you'll see it says throw. But if you stop, it said that's when it says drop. And oh, that totally did hurt me. Great. Oh, nice! We got a Deku shield. I'm so glad we didn't go and buy a Deku shield. Um, let's go over here. So now the question becomes, am I, did I put a Deku shield in the bar on the right? Because, I mean, it is an item you get in this game, but it's not really mandatory, nor is it important. But, I mean, I did for Kokiri Village, and, like, it was important there, so it's like, how the heck do I know when something's important when it's not important? Oh, great. Well, that worked out well. Not really. Okay, I'll just freaking, no, oh, jeez. <laughs> am I dead? I can't tell if I'm, oh, holy crap. Okay, uh, so yes, yeah, so you're supposed to, what you're supposed to do is drop bombs down these little holes in the bridge here. But, uh, instead, I'm just being stupid. Okay, uh, run away, run away, run away. And instead, I'm just standing on his freaking face. I'm like, Bleh. And for some reason, there's a door in the skeleton head. I, no one really understands why, quite frankly. Does anything happen if I go in here? No? Okay, that was worth a try. What about this one? No? Okay, well, now I really need hearts. I might even die from this! Well, now I'm dead. <laughs> I didn't for a second. <laughs> oh, I died a very lavery, fiery death. Till death do us part, which is right freaking now. Continue playing. Of course. It's a horse, of course. Where is this gonna put me out? Good lord. <gasps> Dude! I lost a shield because I landed in the lava! Well, crap, that freaking business scrub's always taunting me. But at the same time, I'm kind of happy I didn't buy and go, go and buy his Deku Shield, because chances are, I would have fallen in the lava at some point anyways. Whatever, let's continue on. Pfft, I don't need no freaking shield. Screw this, Jazz. We'll just attach that. We will buy a Deku Shield eventually, though. Probably out of this dungeon, to be honest. Oh. Maybe we should actually... No, no, never mind. I thought this was something else. I thought it was maybe a hole you drop down and goes to the boss or something. There's another blue switch! Good lord! Oh my good lord. Okay. It's another blue switch. Get down there. Get down there, please, Link. Oh my good lord! Drop. Thank you. When you drop on this switch, it opens the door, but of course it's a blue switch. You, you hop off of it and it closes. <sighs> Much annoy, such anger. There's a block up there. Get away from me, freaking bat! It's gonna drive me batty! <laughs> that's me, that's my new laugh. I wonder if this is supposed to be like some kind of skeleton thing, like, you know, ribs or something. 
or spine related things because I mean we are in the back of a skull although the map totally doesn't make it look like it would be okay according to my notes there should be a skull chill in here somewhere but I have no idea where the heck it is so we're gonna go on an adventure oh no 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 seriously dude you followed me way too far give me a heart or something of course not what a troll bat is there anything behind here I don't think so but it's worth this look see there is not Right, is that a bumble wall? No, that's not a bumble wall. That's not a bumble wall. Is there anything behind here? I don't think so, but I totally want to see. There is not. Interesting that there is not. Uh, I hear you! Oh my god, I smashed B with my freaking thumb so hard. It just didn't work. By the way, as you see, when these fire keys hit me, they like lose their fire because I guess they like transfer the fire to me or some crap. I don't freaking know. <laughs> Um, they can actually relight on fire. Oh, there's a fairy! Oh, not like I had anything to contain it anyways. Yet. <laughs> Do I want to pull this? Can I pull this even? I don't think I can, can I? Oh, I can, but I think this is just a shortcut for here. Unless I'm messing something up forever and I can never complete this game because I'm doing something stupid. Nope. Alright, is there anything here? Probably- SERIOUSLY BATS! These are not hard to- <sighs> Whatever. I'm not mad, I'm not mad. Bro, I'm not even mad. Can you tell that I'm not mad? Um, hopefully that block doesn't go back. Oh, there's another armos. There's a little with legs behind it. Has little wing legs. Oh, hello. Hello. Well, but so there's a sculpture behind it. So let's go grab this. As <laughs> I headbutt the ground, <laughs> and then this asshole's behind me. Oh come on. You would totally gone like. I wonder what happened if I just stayed in that tech screen. That guy would have like hit me and then I wanna be able to move. Oops, don't wanna play in the walk arena. I ain't afraid of no walk arenas. Oh no, the block resets. Welp crap. This is kind of an awkward place to end it off. Seriously, troll bats! Freaking troll bats, man. Trolling and batching. I don't know what that means. Oh, see, we can't pull- I thought maybe pull this block this way, but there's a little blockade there, so there, we couldn't do that. Oh, well, we got the furry back. I totally thought the furry was Navi, but it wasn't. Well, I was gonna end off the episode, but I think it was a bit of a shorter episode last episode, so maybe it doesn't need to be. And why is there a crevice behind this block? There is no reason to push it back at all. I mean, you're just a little poop head if you think there is. <laughs> He's a little silly poop head. You are. You are. Alright, so pull that out enough to just get behind it, and I know the troll bat's gonna come back! The troll bat is totally gonna- Oh, we can't pull left or right in this game. That's weird. Yeah, here you go! You see this troll bat? I see the troll bats! There's two troll bats! Good lord, troll bats. Uh, so yeah, there's fire around, and keys, keys will actually like home in on it and like fly into it to catch fire. Just to annoy you even more. Alright, pull this crap into there. What a perfect fit. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please feel free to like if you're already. My name's Chris. In the next episode, we take on the boss of the Dongle's Cavern. What could it possibly be? Hmm. Well, we saw um, Goma's larvae in the Deku tree, and we've seen the Dongle larvae in this tree. So what could possibly be there? Oh, well, it's cool. This grass grows back, and it gives you infinite supplies. Really neat. So thanks a lot for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!